Hey guys, welcome back to Once Upon DIY. Today we are making locker magnets. If you have not seen our other locker videos, please go check those out. But let's get started. So first, all you need is a cork and a magnet. And don't forget your, you can use a hot glue or Elmer's glue and construction paper. Okay, so your first step is to cut the cork. You can use regular scissors. And all you need is about mm, that much. And it might take a little while to cut through it. But you can see it is cutting it. So let's keep cutting. Okay, now that you have um, cut the cork, it is a little uneven, but that doesn't matter. Um, we can move on to step two. Step two is that you need to cut your paper and place it down on the cork. So I am going to use this grayish blue paper, and it doesn't have to be circular, so I am going to do probably a diamond. So, as you can see, the paper doesn't fully cover the cork, but that does not matter. Um, so, all you need is your glue stick. You need to glue it on to the cork. Not put the paper, like glue, paper, stem cork. It's cork glue paper that is very important and helps it stick better so once you done that you can leave it to dry once you've glued the paper you can personalize your magnet and you can put the letters of your school um you can put the letter of your first name you could just draw on it i think i might do a mandala so, let's do that. Okay, it's step, it's step number three. We need to take our magnet and glue it onto the back of the cork. So, as I said in the beginning, you can use regular Elmer's glue or you can use hot glue. I'm using regular Elmer's hot glue. It might stick better, but it's easier to pull it off. Um, but they both make them stick. So make sure you get a lot on there if you're using Elmer's. And then stick it on. You might want to hold it there for a few um, minutes until it dries. And then you're done. Thanks for watching What's Upon DIY. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below.